This ain't necessary. Not an inch in your dad! Girl, skip, go on, leave me, girl. Yeah, go on, girl. Call your mama for a lot of care. Smart enough, will you? Oh, hell. Wasting my time anyway. Yeah, well. I don't seem to recall hearing mention of that myself. You could have stepped in. I thought you had it covered. Got all the way to Valentine, no problem. Just wait till you're old. I'll head back to Beecher's. At least a man can drink in peace there. Maybe try not to get into any more fights if you can. Only got so many eyes. Oh, come on. <laughs> You'd all be bored as rocks without me. What's the damn holdup? Move! Lucky your head ain't stove in, Uncle. Get a handle on yourself. I don't need luck. I got guys. Hanover Gazette. No, brother Brodus, you. Howdy, friend. My friend. You there? Yeah. What do you want? Do I look like a coward to you? I mean, obviously I do because I look like that milksop there. But tis no matter. Can you help? Maybe. See? Even he is sick of hearing your nonsense, you afterthought of a child! I apologize, sir, for his smell. Why don't we come back here? To somewhere more conducive to displays of utter gallantry and deep-seated inadequacy? What do you have in mind? Shoot a bottle off my head, like William Tell. This is getting silly. Very silly. The man is a moron. Shoot one off mine instead. Uh, I'm the brave one. I'm not scared. I'm a pretty good shot, boys, but... I won't even flinch. I don't want to hurt you. Oh, I can't lose. Either I'll prove my masculinity or die and be spared his company. Come, sir, please. Okay, then. <sighs> Listen, just make sure everybody knows you asked me to do that. Of course, of course, of course. You boys are ridiculous. Don't think too much about it. Just shoot. Good shot. <laughs> <laughs> that was fun. What was? I feel like we didn't even do anything. 
Oh, of course you didn't. We all know you're hardly sentient at all. <laughs> Another round, smaller bottles, sir. Please. What? I don't know. <laughs> Please, this creature is unbearable. He needs silencing. I'll do my best. As long as she witnesses, I'm doing this under duress. Oh, you boys are so silly. Now is as good a time as any. Go for it. Please. There it goes. <laughs> now I'll stand on one leg. Me too. You keep shooting, sir, and this time you kill the beast. He emerged fully formed from the swamps. Helen! Silence, you blackguard. Sir, shoot the wretch. I'm ready. You're deranged. Shoot away, sir. My bottle and his brains, if you please. Bravo! <laughs> now do one while I hop. Do one while I turn somersaults. Uh, shoot me. Oh, give me the gun. Let me shoot him. Uh, for all mankind. I think me and the lady have had enough. Oh, I don't blame you, sir. This man's tongue, I would run too if I could. Here, for your skills and talents. Thank you. Now, brother, I am going to walk Helen home. Don't follow us. She has an elderly aunt, and I fear the sight of you could finally finish her off. Helen, is this creep bothering uh, you? You two, come along. Oh, no, there aren't two. There's me and the lizard man. Please, my angel, do not aggregate us both together. Boys, you are too much. Why too much? No, nope, my sweet. Could you put me down now? Oh, so rough. You're one of the good ones, ain't you? Thank the Lord for that. Will you get me out of here? Will you get me away from these men? Anything I can do to help you in your time of need, ma'am. I'm in residence in Pittsburgh, if that ain't too far. Not at all. Come on. Oh, thank you. That's very... Hunt. We'll need a horse. This is not the right way. You're going in the wrong direction. Why'd you stop, mister? Don't worry, girl. Could we keep moving? really don't want to stay out here. Fine, I'll manage on my own. Hamish. John. Come in. <laughs> so, you said we might go out on a hunt? 
I did. There's this huge she-wolf been stalking me the last few nights I've been out, but she can wait. <laughs> Let's talk a while. Sure. Thanks. So what do you do? Me? Uh, I'm a wanderer. <laughs> I was born further north, spent a lot of time out west. Funny, I never saw myself as a wanderer, man. The bodies lay so thick, you could have walked across the whole field without your boots touching mud. Those were bad times. Mm. Yes, they were. Would you like some more coffee? Mm. Please. Hoo-wee! <laughs> what have we here? Yeah. She's right across there. That close. Oh, ho, 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 ho. she's acting brazen. Come on. Let's mount up. Come on. She went around to the left, around the lake. She's down here somewhere. Keep up. Gotta get her while she's here. Wolves shouldn't come so close to people. Yeah, it's strange. When the whole country was wild, they could go where they liked. Now they're stuck hiding in the few corners of wilderness we got left. It's a feeling with which I can sympathize. This ain't a country for wild animals, nor wild men, neither. Not anymore, it seems. You hear that? Yep. Quickly now. This way. Up there! On the outcrop! You see her? Let's go around! Okay, I'm with you. We're on to her. Come on. Okay. Damn! I can't see her! Let's get up to the top. Have a look around from up there. View loves hills, don't you, boy? You eat them up for breakfast. Whoa there. What we got here? Is that a fresh kill? Could be. Is the blood set? Let me take a look. <laughs> yep. That was her dinner. <laughs> now, where'd she get to? My guess. She's gone somewhere over there. <laughs> There's a whole lot over there. That's the problem. There she is. Got shy all of a sudden. We got some extra miles in you tonight. If we gotta chase her. All right. Come on. Hey, come back. Let's go, girl. somewhere safe. Here you going, girl? There's a wolf about. Leave me, Way girl! There, all right. We got a tracker. Now you want to lead or shall I? If you don't mind, I'd like to. Okay. Tracking. I'll be close behind you. I got the trail. This way.
behind you. Take it slow. You see anything yet? Just tracks. Down here. We don't get her. What's the worst that can happen? She runs off with a chicken? Well, I'm fine with losing chickens. But I lost a leg already. And I gotta pull down my... That's just shit in these woods, so... Yeah. You don't want to lose... Hey, up there. Is that the she-wolf? Oh, Lord, there's one of them. We walked into something here. <laughs> Whoa. You all right? I was ready to offer my complete and unconditional. I don't think the wolves would have showed much mercy. That's quite an ambush she let us into. A bushwhacking, I'd call it. Huh? Where is it? God damn! Over here! Over here! Uh -huh. It's shit! Big son of a bitch. Is that all of them? That's the best of them. Look at them. Proud thing. Scary thing. <laughs> they brought us up here to be slaughtered. You were after a hunt? Yeah. Guess I got hunted. <laughs> you going back to the cabin? Yeah, nah. Still early. We'll stay up here a while. Dress this animal. I won't likely see another like him for some time. I hope I won't either. <laughs> Thanks for taking me out. Yeah, anytime. You want to go out again? Yeah. You come by and see me. So long, man. Yeah. Wait. Here's a pelt. Thank you. Uh, you earned it. So long. Yeah. He could speak stories he'd tell. kind of wolf you gotta be to get this big. Almost a shame we killed it. Said. And now the two of you have betrayed me at once. Do you know what betrayal means, Bertram? No. It means hurting Miss Marjorie. Oh, I thought you liked me. I've clothed you. I fed you. Bertram does like Miss Marjorie. Yes. And Miss Marjorie likes Bertram. So why don't you go and tell me where that nasty little Magnifico has run off to so I can get on with weapon that's not nose running into shape? He owes me. He owes us. Big time. Bertram and Marjorie. Would Bertram like a sherry? Bertram like sherry. <laughs> yes, he does. <laughs> Barkeep, Sherry. Make it the cheapest one you have. Rat piss will do. This pretty dance. Everything okay? A 
Imagine saving people, taking them to your breast, and metaphorically, I mean, like a mother, caring and raising them, and then they go and stab you in the back. Have you ever betrayed a close friend? I hope not. Whoa. Treachery. And these are sad, low, unlovable people, and I made them stop. Dreamers, entertainers, and they... Oh, no, now family's not enough. No, no, he's gone off alone. My little tiny magician has gone and stabbed his mom on the back. Oh, fuck it, he... No, Bertram, Bertram, Bertram! Woof, woof, Bertram! Put the nice man down! Do something, you only eat him! Um, easy there. Easy there! Sherry! My <sighs> Easy, big guy. Uh. Okay? No fair! Naughty! Naughty! Easy, boy! <laughs> Bertram, eat this! Tell whoever you started it. Come here, Bertram. <laughs> oh, yes, Marjorie's here. No one's gonna hurt you ever again. Mama. You should keep that thing in a cage. Maybe you should think about who you're serving. Give me a beer, will you? Don't worry. We'll pay for what we broke. Come here, Bertram. Oh, no one looks after you like Mama does. No one cares for you like I do. Especially not that Magnifico, hmm? But he's my friend. Yes, well, if he were your friend, he'd be here, wouldn't he? He wouldn't have abandoned us. Oh, you wouldn't have gotten that whoopsie, would you? Whoopsie heart. I know. Mama's gonna make it all better. But first, you gotta tell me where that little worm ran off to, hmm? Bertram promised. Yes, well, Magnifico made a promise, too, huh? He made more than a promise. He made a contract, and he broke it. So you just tell me exactly where he is, and then we will all be even. That's my boy. He's camping in the woods. Why didn't you tell me in the first place? You just apologize to these men. I'm sorry. Yeah. I'm sorry. You gave me a whoopsie. You just stay away from that share, you hear? Bertram likes sharing. Oh, don't you get him started. Thank you for all of your help, Mr. Stranger. If you see that slippery little fella sleeping rough out there, would you just make a little racket and then we'll come along and we'll find you? I could try. Oh, his name is Magnifico. You'll know him when you see him. Come along, Bertram. <sighs> That's amazing. If you say so. Oh, are you Magnifico by any chance? I'm not going back. She's a witch! She's a witch! Who? Presta! Marjorie. She cares about you a lot. Well, I'm the talent. It's me. It's all me. I share the money with her and, uh, you know, that thing. No, stay away. You've made love to her, haven't you? That's not it. She's a succubus. She's a succubus! Ah! Stay away from me! Hey, partner! Come back here! What the hell? Look, you got the wrong end of this! Running ain't solving anything! Hey! Will you talk? I'm going in alone! We're going in! Starting to irritate me. What the hell are you pulling here? If you're here, I'm gonna find you. Hey, 
steak dinners, and dance at Oblivion! Obscura! <coughs> now where are you going? Magnifico? Can't magic out of this, partner. Come on now. She ain't as bad as all that. Want to see a trick? <laughs> and you led me on a merry old dance. Come on down. Lady said you had a contract. You want me? Come and get me. <laughs> hey, hold on there. God so damn long, it. dummy. the Great White Way. Really? You got enough for a ticket? Pa. Because the way Big Fanny tells it, you spent all of our takings on a case of the French pox. Maybe I did. So what? What do you need a stump of a showman for? Same bad jokes? The same cheap tricks? In a package half the size? You got Bertram. You got Dummy over there. Who is Dummy anyway? The missing link? <laughs> oh, <laughs> shut up, you dimwit. You sold me out. You should watch your mouth. You don't need me. You're better off without me. Even you, dummy. Go on, clear off. Aim for the top, all of you. I'm out of food and I'm out of ideas. Leave me for the bears. I won't be more than a mouthful. You robbed me. Whoa. You robbed your brother. So you are going to be pulling rabbits out of your ass until you are as old as you are tiny. Put them up there. Oh, some friends, some friends. We ain't friends. <laughs> We're family, as much as it pains me to say it. Family? Still after everything? Well, of course, you silly little man. And him? Let him at the bar agree to help. Ah, sleeping rough don't suit me much. I know. Come to Mama. Oh, I did miss you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now, don't you ever run off on us like that again. Back together! Back together! Well, I'm glad everything worked out. Thanks to you. Thank him, boys. Thank you. Uh, thanks for nothing, dummy. No get in the back. We ought to give you a piece of the gate on our next show. You earned it. Huh? We'll be playing Saint Denis next. Check with the box office. Here. No one said anything about splitting the gate. Oh, shut up. Half man and a half wit. Bye bye. What I done to deserve you two? 